So hey guys, welcome back to Billy Dragon Reptile. So today I thought I'd just do a short video on our Sharp and Call Albino Boas. So right now this is just our Sharp female uh, Albino Boa. Um, so what I know about these guys is just that one guy invented the Call, which was pretty much every Albino Boa you can get out there. And then someone, I, guess, I think it's Peter... Peter Sharp that did the Sharp Albino strain and this this is our female Sharp I've been looking for a male to go f with her for a long time oh she's starting to wake up now that's it's a totally different color I don't remember what albinos are what I think lipstick lipstick albino and coral glow albino are call the calls right below us in the other PVC here but she's very, very friendly. She eats like a pig. Great temperament. I take her out. I'm just, I'm doing this on my phone, so I can't do it with one hand. She's very heavy. Um, but totally different looking. Very pretty. But I assume it's just two different guys. One guy, I guess, the call, got his hand on albino first when they were first coming out. And then Peter Sharp got his hands on albino. They bred them together, and they were not compatible. So I guess the babies, I was hoping the babies would come out double het, but I can't even find any information if the babies do come out double het. I'm so I'm assuming you just get a bunch of normal looking babies that aren't double het. They could be single het, double het, nothing. Even though she is visual, you should get all normals that are het for sharp. Is how it works usually, I thought, when I did stuff. But apparently not. So I'm not 100% sure how it works with them. But I would love to find a male to go with her because she is very pretty. And I know you can get hets, but here at Belly Drivers we really want a visual to go with her to make her pop. Because she's going to make some gorgeous babies. Oh, there she is. Hello, girl. Very pretty. I think she's going to be upgrading to a bigger home soon. And she's probably hungry again. And the call. If I just move from here, pardon the swing. That's the call male. So a little bit of a different yellow. Apparently Sharp keeps their colors a little bit better. The call is a little bit different. And we're looking, oh sorry, that's a, supposedly it's not a normal albino, it's a coral glow albino male. So we need one to go with that. We need a female to go with that and a male with the Sharp. So these are something we'll be looking very forward to breed really pretty I mean they don't they don't get huge just really yellow really pretty like I said I'll just keep the video short today I don't have much right now I just thought I'd do a quick video on our our, uh, our boas I have a normal above them but everyone knows what a normal boa looks like well most people here I'll just do a quick there, normal boa. Fascinating. Normal boa. That's a male, but I'm not breeding it to that. So then I'll just get heads. I don't want that. I want visuals. But. Very pretty. So, I thought I'd just get everyone an update on our boas and our plans for them. Hopefully we'll get them breeding next year if we find big enough females and males and We'll do it that way and hopefully produce some offspring with them, which would be pretty cool. So thanks for watching and have a great day, everyone.